Friends, finally the wait is over. Much awaited RB grade B notification has come as paper cuttings. Okay, so uh, here is a screenshot of our paper cutting. For grade B posts, there are 222 vacancies. Enough vacancies for us, right? Because we only need one seat. And phase 1 examination is scheduled on July 9th of 2023. And phase 2 examination is on July 30th. Uh, so there's only a gap of 20 days between phase 1 and phase 2 So we need to uh, use the maximum of these two months Okay, we need to prepare for phase 2 as well We have two months and we need to cover at least management and uh, one of the subjects from finance and management or ESI Okay, and we need to uh, read regular articles for English as well and for uh, Department of Economic and Policy Research, there is a vacancy of 38 and the examination is scheduled on July 16th and September 2nd. And for uh, DSIM force, the vacancy is 31. Phase 1 examination will be on July 16th and phase 2 will be August 19th. Okay, currently the application link is not open. That will be open from May 9th to June 1, June 9th. Okay, one month time. So we will be starting a two month preparation journey to RB grade B as we have done in NABAT grade A examination. I hope that uh, that was helpful for you and uh, through this video series we will be covering weekly targets. Okay, I will be posting my weekly targets for RB grade B. Okay, so uh, you can adapt to that and you can take whatever you want from that series. Okay. Uh, then what i don't need to say that our, our big grade b is what kind of job and like that uh, this is every banker's dream job right and there are other people only preparing for rba grade b right this is also my dream job i don't need to prepare for any other examination after i get into rba grade b and there are some people who uh, will go for upsc as well so uh, this is my dream post rba grade b in RBA grade B, we will get a basic pay of 55,200 rupees and a grade allowance of 11,500 rupees, a dearness allowance of 32,500 rupees that will increase on month to month, and a special allowance of 9,750 rupees. And approximately, we will get a monthly salary of 1,17,000 rupees. This is salary only. Uh, the, after deductions, the enhanced salary would be approximately 1,5,000 rupees. Okay, apart from the salary, we will get a leased accommodation uh, that will be around 60 to 70,000 rupees. So, we can afford a Porsche, Porsche life. Okay, and we will get a petrol allowance for uh, 200 liters of petrol. Even if you multiply it with 100 per liter, we will end cash into 20,000 rupees. So, uh, adding all of this, we will get a monthly salary of approximately 1,50,000 rupees and a fantastic tension free life. Okay. Uh, I don't know whether it is tension free or not that will depend upon the individual okay and we will work in the only central bank of India okay so we'll be posting uh, weekly targets as I said before so let us see there